Good and welcome to the sports segment here on New Day. Today we are going to be focusing on the Indian Wells, uh, Novak Djokovic and Victoria Azarenka emerged victors and winners of the 2016 uh, Indian Wells. And also in the English Premier League, Leicester City have maintained the lead at the top of the table after their victory over Crystal Palace as uh, Tottenham Hotspur has also defeated Bournemouth plus several other victories in the English Premier League. We'll bring you the highlights subsequently in the La Liga as well. Real Madrid emerged the biggest winners on the day. We'll tell you you exactly what that means and we start locally because in the Ghana Premier League match day five Accra had to folk traveled to the Temma Park to face Inter Allies and came back from two goals down to win by three goals to two drama at the Temma Park with Kenichi Yatsuhashi <laughs> Now, after that game, some controversy because some inter allies uh, officials are, you know, uh, suspecting, uh, you know, the goalkeeper Kwame Ba for taking some bribes uh, from Accra Hearts of Folk. But of course, some controversy uh, always after some uh, drama like uh, that in a game as pulsating as it was at the Tema Park last Sunday. But some other results in the Ghana Premier League: Techiman City beat Dreams FC by one goal to nil. While All Stars also defeated New Odibiase by a goal to nil. Kumasi Asante Kotoko also secured their first win of the season over second D Hazakes. Ediana Stars travelled to Ashanti Gold and also played out a 1-1 draw. Yaya Mohamed, the scorer, uh, you know, fought that equaliser for Ediana Stars in that particular game. But Haha to Folk now have 13 points and are top of the table, uh, you know, followed by Wild All Stars and Dreams FC and the others also in there. Kumasia Sante Kotoko, if you're looking for your side, then you are 11th place, uh, you know, on the league log after match day five. Medema Sporting Club, remember, they were also uh, in action but not in the Ghana Premier League. They were in the CAF Confederations Cup and they were trailing by a goal to nail from Ali Tihad, but they defeated uh, Ali Tihad by two goals to nail, meaning that they have uh, advanced to the next round on 2-1 aggregate score line in that particular competition. But away from that, we go straight to the English Premier League. Uh, but before then, let's just take a listen to the manager of Accra Hatsu Folk and also Inter Allies, Kenichi Yatsuhashi and Herbert Ado speaking after that particular 3-2 uh, uh, game. It's a very good game, but uh, we gave Hearts of Oak the points. We are leading 2 0 half time, we were not touching the ball, we were, we were doing all the football. We shall have scored more goals in the first half. But you know this young boy, inexperienced, he scored one, he scored two, and he goes to their head. And I was trying to ask them to concentrate, but you know, they are young players, and uh, some of them have never played with Premier before. 
So they lack the concentration, they lack the grit. How to, uh, in fact, they were so desperate, they had to do anything. They had to kick, they had to run, they, had, they did everything. And their, 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 substitution, their substitution was good because the guy who came in was very, very strong. In fact, two of them, uh, Fulvi and the other guy, they were very, very strong. They were fresh, they came in, and they were able to bulldoze their way through. So it's good for, it's good for her to go. Uh, it's also good for us in a way that we have to learn. And I hope our boys have learned something. So I hope that next time, if we play them tomorrow, they not get the same chance. So I'm very disappointed. I came for the three points. I knew I've got the three points. But then they took it away from us. Or we gave them the three points, which is very, very disappointing. And I'm very disappointed with that. So now the points, the points build up is gone down. I was hoping we will close up and then look at the other matches. But that is football. This is the fifth match. So I'm looking at the next five matches. If we can recoil and regain our points back. There's no word I can describe. Inter Allah is a um, very strong side and uh, they made everything difficult for us to win and they deserve a lot of credits uh, for making this difficult to win. And when they score a second goal, we have to gamble it. So we took a risk, we changed our, our tactics and the formations. And however, our players exceeded my expectation. So all credit again goes to uh, my players. It's only fifth game out of 30 games we have to play. I mean, it's too, too hard to uh, talk about success or anything. Yes, we are happy that uh, we won this game, but there are a long way to go. No, nothing to do with what we are strong or anything. I think we are smarter to play second half, despite the fact that uh, they score uh, a second goal against us but we are still playing with a lot of heart and effort and the determination to uh, win the game I think it's more than tactics or uh, fitness our players had a strong determination to win so uh, I think it's their work that we won the game So uh, coach Kenichi Yatuhashi obviously very much excited after the 3-2 result over Inter Allies and Hearts of Oak fans went absolutely ballistic after that particular game. Coach Ebetado, he was once a coach of a crowd who folk the first time. He went through the season without losing a game. So we all know who he is and what kind of profile he brings to uh, he brought to Accra House of Hope and what kind of profile he has now as a coach of uh, entire lives. Uh, I had a personal chat with him and he told me that he's going to use his young boys. His boys are young and they, they, are, they are going to run Accra House of Hope now. And I'm surprised at the end of the day uh, they have been run down. House is House of Hope. I mean, uh, there's no way. I mean, uh, 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 he can compare the pedigree of Interlice to Accra So I'm not sure he's going to take this defeat, this defeat too hard. He should just accept that he played against a better team. So you see football, that is what you see in here. Because um, you see everybody is shocked. Everybody is full of fear. You understand? As a folk team now, when we play first half, second half, we have to get some salute. Because that is exactly what is happening. Kenneth Yasuashi has brought something in Ghana football. Especially in Accra. I salute him. I feel bad. I feel bad for myself. I feel bad. At the time to go out, my brother has told me that God will make it, we tear the goat, we we'll make it three one. But I feel that today, how you feel today, the next time you we'll continue. The boys are very good. They are very good. In fact, they are fantabulous. In fact, to be two nailed down and coming back to equalize and to win the last game, but they are too much. Oh, you need for us. I need you more. I need you win all the matches for us. Has never said that. Has never said that. It is not easy for you to come back by two goals to nil in Tema Sports Stadium on an Afro turf that we are not used to it. I tell you that as a folk, we never see that again. And I tell you that right now, I can walk raising my chest in the streets of Mima without any fear because as a folk is making me Kenichi, Mirisa, Yashuashi, because I feel it, yeah, yeah, I feel it, yeah, yeah, I feel it, I feel it, I feel it, yeah, yeah, I feel it, I feel it, yeah, yeah, I feel it. 
football and how it gets excitement out of its fans. Anyway, away from Ghana League, we go straight to the English Premier League. And Leicester City maintained their lead at the top of the table, now have 66 points after their victory over Crystal Palace. Tottenham Hotspur has also defeated Bournemouth by three goals to nil and are now on 61 points. And some of the big games of last weekend happens to be between Manchester City and Manchester United. Marcus Rashford, the youngster, keeps impressing uh, for the Red Devils. He got the match winner for Manchester United as uh, Liverpool's uh, joint club also was left uh, dejected after that particular game against Southampton at the St. Mary's Stadium because his side, after 22 minutes, went up by two goals to nail but allowed uh, Southampton uh, you know, to come into that particular game. Just not the equaliser, but of course also got a, uh, you know, a, a much winning uh, you know, a much winning goal in that particular game to ensure that Southampton won by three goals to two. So that's it for sports from us here on New Day.